Hello hackers, welcome to the new video where we are going to hack improtected admin functionality with improtectable URL. So in this lab, there is unprotected admin panel. It's located at unprotectable location. So this is, can be a very good sign for us that this admin panel can be based in the nav bar, but the location is disclosed somewhere in the application. So this is another sign that we are going to focus on the source code. And to solve the lab, we have to find this admin panel and then use its functionality to delete user call it callous. So guys, before moving forward, please don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and let's start. And uh, here we go, guys. So the first step, let me activate Foxy Proxy. I'm using Community Edition. And then let's go to the proxy, enter spec twice, and then let's go to HTTP history. So before moving forward, let me refresh the page. So as the previous lab, we found the hidden admin panel used robots.txt. So let me try the same in here and let me see if I can find something. So let's say robots.txt and here we go. So nothing found, unfortunately, let me back to the application. So now let me see these items. So let me see the first one, view details. Let me scroll down if I will find something in here. So nothing looks interesting. So let me go to my account. Okay, let me try the admin and password of admin. Let me see if this works or not. Also, it doesn't. And now let me focus on this nav bar. As we saw in the lab description that there is something hidden in the source code and we are going to focus on this nav bar. So now let me get one of these endpoints and let me test. So let me start with the home page and here we go. Let me make it more bigger so we can see. And now in here, in case that this is an admin panel, let me search for the words admin and maybe I will find something. And here we go guys. Now you can see we have 11 matches. One of them is related to the title. So I am not going to focus on this. So let me move forward and here we go. This is not interesting. And here we go. Let me see this one. And now you can see we have is admin equal to false. We have this condition. And as you can see, we found this script tag, which means this is a JavaScript code. And here we go. So now we have if is admin, which means if this is true, then we are going to launch this code. So let's read it one by one and see what I have in here. So as you can see, we have the top links tag document dot get elements by class name. So which means we have this tag. Let me just search it. So we have the top links. Let me search it in here. So we have the section and then we have the home. So this is definitely the nav bar. As you can see, we have a home. Then we have this symbol in here. And then we have a script, then we have my account, which is this one, which means we have something in between these two tags is the admin panel, I think. So let's continue reading to understand the source code. So then we have admin panel tag, which is document and then create element A. So this is absolutely the same as this one, which means a tag. And then we have set attribute to href. So this is absolutely similar to this one. And then it's going to get this value, which is slash admin. And then we have a random character and it's going to be named admin panel. We have home, this symbol, and then we have admin panel, then this symbol, and then my account. So let me try to get this href. So this is absolutely the directory. Let me copy it and let me go in here and let me test it. And here we go, guys. Now we finally find the admin panel. So here we can see that we have unprotected admin functionality where we can delete user winner and the user callous. And my duty is to delete the callous user. So let me do it. And uh, here we go. Now we finally solve the lab. I hope that you learned how to think outside the box to find some sensitive pages like the admin panel and then use its content to make some damage as deleting user call it careless. 
So guys, if you liked my video, please don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and if you have any question or need any help, please put it in the comment below, and stay tuned for the next videos.